this part of your orientation, we're going to talk about how to access ADP, which is our employee self-service portal. Once you've logged into the at the top of the screen, click on the tab that says at your fingertips. From there, scroll down to where it says ADP Workforce Now. After clicking that, a new tab for ADP will open. When logging in for the first time, you'll be asked to create your login information. Make sure to choose a password that you can remember, but not one that can be easily guessed by others. Once you've logged in using your new credentials, you'll be taken to the ADP home screen, which gives you quick access to the features you will likely use on a regular basis. These quick access sections might be in slightly different locations on your own ADP profile, so make sure to check for the appropriate heading to find what you need. One of the first sections you will see should be your time card. Clicking this will show you information relating to your schedule and amount of hours worked each week. You should also see a section called My Pay. This will have important information about your pay statement and tax information. Another useful section if you are a regular full-time employee or a part-time employee who works at least 20 hours per week is your time off balances. This will have information about your vacation time as well as sick leave once you've finished your new hire probationary period. At the top of the screen, you will have tabs that give access to additional information. Most of this regarding the business office will be under the tab Myself. From there, you can view various resources relating to pay as well as your time and attendance. In your free time, explore ADP to see the variety of features it has available to help make the behind-the-scenes part of your new position easier.